Yo, yo, yo keep your distance. Keep your distance. Hey, it's your boy Nathan here, aka Six Cinema. Welcome back. And if you're new to the channel, Six Cinema, you know, because we in the six, T. Dotto. <laughs> so the reason I started this page is because when I was a beginner photographer, I'd look up to guys like Peter McKinnon, and he held it down, you know. He's bringing these quick tips for you to learn photography skills, videography skills, whatever you're into, whatever camera you got, it doesn't matter. We got another good one for you tonight. It's approximately nine o'clock. I'm gonna head out, even though it's quarantine. I gotta get my walks in, you know what I'm saying? So why not go for a walk and take my camera with me? Because, hey, my camera is a part of my body now. And we're gonna go outside today and I'm gonna teach you how to do light trail photography. It's one of those things is it's it's not hard, but once you get it and you find all the little things that are cool with light trails, you can catch some dope photos. So um let's head out. Okay, before we head out, I just gotta grab a couple things, you know, the essentials to be a, a YouTuber. I, yeah, I guess I'm I'm actually I'm a YouTuber now. I'm a YouTuber. Forget I'm a YouTuber. Uh, YouTubers usually grab like a guru oh I have the gorilla pot on now. Um, let's just head out. Just grab my other camera here. So even if you're new to photography and you just bought your camera, light trails is probably one of the easier things you'll be able to figure out and it looks dope. So the first tip that I'll give you when doing light trail photography is make sure you have a tripod. That is key. You want to have your camera stable whenever you're doing this type of photography. Either it's a tripod or a gorilla pod. Just make sure you have something so the camera is not moving at all. Oh, there he comes. Hey, oh, social distancing. We got to keep the distance. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> you ready to shoot? Forward. Yeah, go to new. Ready to shoot? Forward. Okay, let's yeah. go. Alright, so I got my model now. Now uh, what we need is we need lights. And as you can see, there's uh, not many lights around here. Because uh, you probably can't see me. Or you probably can't see me because I got that low light capability now. That low, low light. But uh, we're heading to King Street, downtown Toronto, Liberty Village area. Uh, to find some street cars because street cars be blessed with lights. And there's also street lights, so let's hit it. Okay, so the next thing you gotta do is set your shutter speed. When I usually do light trail photography, I like setting my shutter speed between eight and 12 seconds. All you wanna do now is just check your ISO and your aperture to make sure you have enough light coming into the camera so you get a crisp photo, but the shutter speed is where it's at. That's where you're gonna get these light streams. Okay, so the last tip I have for you that will really help is just like the camera and the tripod, you have to find a model that stays still because if your model doesn't, see? Like that. You see, if your model doesn't stay still, then it's gonna be the same as not having a tripod for your camera. Those are some of the tips I have for light trail photography. Hopefully they helped and you can go out there and try them for yourself. But I'm gonna get rid of this guy, my model. Thanks for coming out, bud. Yeah, thanks buddy. But I'll throw all of his socials down below. Okay, I'm probably gonna cut all that because that was way too long. But let's take it back inside and I'll show you how some of these photos turned out. Okay, we're back inside now. I just dropped the card on my computer. I'm gonna go through and see if I can find any photos that are good for Instagram. Do a little quick edit on them. If you wanna take a look, you can follow me on Instagram at Six Cinema. It's at Six Cinema across all platforms, so it's easy to find. I'll still throw all the links down below. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. Uh, I'm gonna be posting new videos every Sunday, and I'll be back next week for y'all. Take it easy. Peace.